Hey guys, Nate here. Welcome back to Nate's Journey. Um, so today I want to go over with you guys a couple of things that I do before and after my workout, um, but mostly before because um, I want to just get warmed up. I don't want to feel muscle tension from prior workouts. So what I'll do is uh, I'll get this rolling pin right here um, from the kitchen. I'll take plastic wrap, wrap it around it um, because basically this is marble and you know you want this to go right on your skin you don't really want clothes on you know you kind of want just right on the skin you know work it in better um, you know I'm not gonna pull my shirt off but as you can see right here my arm um, you know literally don't even put any pressure on it you can literally just go just like that just you know just like that and on the bicep you know right on the long head right on the short head um, and just go down the forearm and um, basically just don't apply pressure. Just let the rolling pin, and that's why you don't want to use a foam roller because they don't have much weight to them. This has weight to it and that is perfect because you don't have to press down hard and you don't really have to, you know, um, you know, do anything crazy. Um, you know, pressing down too hard is you're, you're going to hurt yourself. You don't, you don't want to do that. Um, so like, you know, on leg days and stuff like that, I'll roll out my, my hamstrings, my quads, my calves, um, and we'll just basically do that. And then biceps, triceps, I'll even hit my shoulders sometimes. It's kind of hard to hit your shoulders. Um, cause you know, you got a lot of, you know, a lot of bone here and it's kind of hard to really go on the shoulder. Um, also what's really good too is, you know, have somebody do it for you. You can actually roll out your back and your back's really good to roll out. You know, if you have a very muscular back, um, you need a lot of lactic acid buildup after a workout. So it's really good to kind of go over that with a roller and basically make sure that you're set to go. I mean, but yeah, I would definitely wrap it up because this is actually really cold. This is marble. And uh, yeah, no, it's definitely a lot cooler than room temperature. So you're basically gonna wanna do that. Um, and yeah, I mean, this is, this is really effective just kind of get the muscles feeling good, reduce like swelling, um, tension, whatever you have. This is great. There's not really much uh, to say about it. It just works really well. Um, you know, I don't have to get too scientific here. I think it's kind of common knowledge of what this will do for you. Um, so, I mean, this is really a great piece of equipment. Honestly, and people, you know, for me personally, I think stretching, um, and I used to never stretch before I worked out or after, but I think stretching and uh, doing doing things like this, going for recovery and stuff like that is pretty much as important as working out. And so is eating and so is staying hydrated and so, and so is all that. Because you gotta think, like sure you're lifting weights, but if you're not eating right, um, you're not gonna get the results you want. Um, so obviously that's really important. Um, and yeah, I mean, this is, you know, these rolling pins, I'm not really sure what these cost. I've had this in the house for, for years. So I'm not really sure what this is going to cost somebody, but there's probably other things you can get. I mean, you know, I would do this. I would ice your muscles. I would do a lot of other things just to make sure um, that you feel good before you work out. Because if you don't feel good before you work out, you're going to be tired. You're going to be fatigued. You're not going to feel good. And you're not going to want to finish that rep, that set even work out in general so this right here excellent really good I recommend you get one right now these are really good if you know if you're dedicated to working out if you're gonna work out a few times a week uh, one two three four five times a week um, but I wouldn't push five times um, so I mean yeah no I'm just gonna you know I mean this isn't really a, um, a rolling pin review there's so many uses for this in the kitchen. You're rolling out dough. Use it for your your um your muscles. Everything. I mean, you're pretty much. You know, this is a great. It's just a great source of equipment. It's really good. Uh, I'm gonna rate this a nine out of ten. Um, because it's really good for everything. It works. This is really good. Okay, I can't really say much more. I know I'm kind of rambling on, but yeah, no. You want to just you want to make sure you're rolling out. Um just to reduce tension, inflammation, and, you know, let the acid, or the lactic acid uh, flow out of the muscles. 
easier, quicker, and more efficient. But uh, yeah, guys, so uh, I'm going to end it right there. That was basically just a rolling pin. I mean, like I said, really good, beneficial. Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a great day. Stay active, stay fit, stay strong. God bless.